Got my little pea shooter, it's a little 44 mag, a little lever action, nothing crazy. Sorry, I got my coffee up here by <laughs> let me let me grab that real quick. Don't want y'all getting too excited about that. Uh so guys, I'm back. I'm back. Sorry for the hiatus. Hatus, however you say it. We took a long one. Also, I'm a little nasally. Uh, I don't know what I got, so I'm socially distancing from everybody except you guys on YouTube. I can talk to y'all, so I think that's pretty cool. Ooh, let me put those over there. Wind up losing them. I lost my old pair. I don't know where they went. Suckers just, poof, disappeared, you know? Yeah, so I'm back, I'm back. Happy to be back, hoping to be back for good. I think I got everything kind of figured out to where I don't have to take no more hiatuses. <laughs> no, that's such a funny word. But um, anyway, yeah, we're getting there, guys. My hair grew back. I mean, it's been a, it's been a minute since I've seen y'all. Uh, anyway, got text, hold on a second. You know, 2020 has sucked. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna get up here and, you know, say it's been the best year of my life or anything, but it's been a good year. For me, it has been a good year. I made the decision to make a lot of changes in this year, and that is really, I feel, set me up for 2021. I realized around March, April time frame that like this year was already gonna be pretty much like, not a waste, but it was gonna be very difficult to operate in the capacity that a lot of people were probably wanting to operate in. And so that's when I kind of decided I wasn't really going to set up the roastery. I was going to focus more on moving and getting down here, getting all that kind of situated because the thing is, is like I, I talked about it in repair everything video in that vlog. You have to have that solid foundation because if you do not have that solid foundation, it's going to be super hard to get where you want to go later down the road. You're going to hit roadblocks a lot sooner, whether it be monetarily or family or just logistic. I decided around, you know, probably March, April time frame to basically start focusing on how to prepare for 2021 and that's kind of what we're gonna hit 2021 hard so I finally moved I got the move completely done I got the my, my little home set up over there I got my coffee shack completely just full of stuff and my trucks right here it's broke it's broken my wife has been on me about my language uh, broken it's broken I really don't have time to fix it right now so we're in the works we're having a third child so we need to get like a van type thing so we've been doing that Whew! all the things all the things so what I was struggling with in the beginning before I moved was my roaster was down here a lot of my stuff was down here Moving time. Woo. Just getting a new home baby Just getting a new home so far we've had some good luck haven't dropped it yet to cut bills down you know, I was paying for my mortgage and everything and like I needed a dedicated area to operate and video out of so that's gonna be kind of my next focus over the next few months is creating like a little studio atmosphere that way y'all don't just have to look out into trees and stuff every time I create a video you know so why changing and moving is essential to me nothing is worse than knowing that there's a problem and you just continuously 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 not fix it so finally you know, my wife and I sat down and we're like, look, here's all of our struggles right now. Most of our issues come down to bills and having this house. We can cut expenses if we sell this place and move down here, get a little mobile home type deal and start fresh, you know? So this is basically what we did. Moved down here, now I'm literally across the driveway from my roaster. I got the shop over here and I'm gonna start getting everything set back up. It's gonna take a little bit. I'll be dead honest with you. I'd much rather be making videos about coffee and drinking good coffee than out here laying these little pipes and digging these trenches and stuff, but it's running pipes, guys. Running pipes. Running pipes. It ain't fun. Somebody's got to do it, though, you know? But I think the biggest thing is just allowing yourself to go through all the emotions that go along with moving and changes and stuff like that because like that's when you feel alive it allows it to be more memorable like you remember that struggle you remember that hardship experiences like that that are memorable and stuff like that they, they just make life feel a lot longer we're going to be doing a lot more stuff i just ran my 50 mile race here the other day super cool completed it so that was exciting i got that video coming out next i'm actually working on it right now i'm kind of working on these videos parallel also I got this new little roaster hive roaster I messed up the roast on it pretty bad I made a good one on it the other day I was doing one yesterday I was kind of rushing you know because my wife was like you got 10 minutes yeah which means I got about 12 13 you know in actuality I went out there I 
fired the little stove up, you know. She makes me do it outside on the back porch, or on the front porch now. Put the half roaster on there and I went to just I'll do a video on it later on down the road, but anyway. It never hit first crack. I think I had too many, too much green coffee in there. And it was windy outside and it was just, you know, not good. So 13 minutes come up, I'm starting to get the hint that I need to come back in. You know, she's cooking Thanksgiving dinner and stuff. So we dropped it before first crack, coffee. I, I mean, it's honestly not that bad. Anyway, guys, again, I'm back. Truly appreciate y'all hanging out. Got a bunch of videos in the works. I made a huge list over my absence. And yeah, we got we got tons of things coming up. I got a roaster series. I'm gonna, I've done hit up a few roasters for that. Trying to work around COVID. That's just put a damper on so many things, dude. COVID, like I hate even hearing the word now, you know? It's like, geez Louise. Anyway, love y'all. Peace out. If y'all have any questions, hit me up. Glad to be back. Glad to be back, guys. Anyway, peace out. Love y'all. Oh, I'm an idiot. I don't know if y'all need to know all that, but you know, hey, it, it happens.